Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if the mouse and keyboard are not working in Windows 11. So before we dive in into any solutions, just make sure of the following. Check the mouse and keyboard connections. Before you head to any complex methods, it's imperative to check the connections. Otherwise, if you're using Bluetooth devices, verify that the keyboard and mouse are well within range and show connected in the settings. And another thing to take in consideration is to restart your PC. As simple as it may sound, it can solve a lot of issues. To do so, just select the Windows button, then click on the power icon and then choose the restart option. Afterwards, check if the problem still persists. So the first solution that you should take in consideration is to update the mouse and keyboard drivers in Windows 11 or reinstall them. To do this, you have to right-click the Windows button and then select Device Manager from the list of options. In the Device Manager window, make sure to expand the Mice and Other Pointing Devices section and then right-click on the problematic driver and select the Update Driver option. In here, just click on Search automatically for drivers and Windows will try to find the best possible driver for your PC. Now all you have to do is repeat the same procedure for the keyboard. Double-click the keyboard section and then do the same by right-clicking and selecting the update driver option. Now if you want to reinstall them in case the update driver doesn't work, just right-click the problematic driver and select the uninstall device. Now make sure to confirm by pressing the uninstall button and do the same for the keyboard option and then restart your PC, because restarting your PC will reinstall the drivers. Now you can just check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to run the keyboard troubleshooter. To do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon, and then on the left pane make sure to select system, and afterwards on the right side scroll down until you find the troubleshoot section and click it. In here click on other troubleshooters, and then just scroll down until you find the keyboard troubleshooter and just click on the run button next to it. Now Windows will try to detect any issues with the keyboard and fix it if possible. And lastly another great solution is to remove recently installed Windows updates. To do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon, and then on the left pane make sure to scroll down until you find the Windows Update section and select it. Now on the right side make sure to click on Update History. In here just scroll way down until you find the Uninstall Updates option and select it. Now you can just select the update that you want to remove and then click on the Uninstall button. And that's it, you can check if the problem still persists. Plenty of solutions to consider, isn't it? As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.